Welcome to how to run Black Ops 3 on a potato. Let's go. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is head over to menu. You want to go into options and graphics. You want to go into your render resolution, 50%, and your screen resolution to 800 by 600. This is the most important part. And then lower all the other graphic settings to as low as you want. Just the lowest possible. Just do it. Yeah. Yeah. Make sure there's no motion blur either. Screw that. And then yes, save and apply those changes and you will notice the transformation. You will notice. <laughs> Alright, so uh, how does this affect gameplay? Well, you decide. Okay, so um, the recording software for some reason put black bars around the edges of the screen, but uh, my perspective, I was able to see it full screen, just, just to let you know, so you're not going to get the black bars, I think. But yeah, just look at that loading screen. Oh yeah, oh yeah, you can definitely read those texts. Mm. Oh, look at that front post. Oh my goodness, it is so ugly, but it runs pretty well actually. There's just a frame rate cap on PC, it can only really go up to 250. Oh my goodness, look at the front, oh my, the dot is just a square, it's like Minecraft. It's like Minecraft. It's like sub Minecraft textures. That's what these are. That's basically what this is. It's sub Minecraft. But you got really good frame rates and potatoes can run it. So yeah. Oh yeah, goodness. Look at those plants. Look 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 at the plants. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Look at the plants. Oh my god, that is creepy as hell. That is creepy as hell. Okay. Bye-bye. And off your arm. The other arm. If I can hit it. And the leg. But I don't think you could shoot the leg off, so psh, screw that. I don't know what that is. There's another freaky mannequin. Oh, look at those fire effects. Oh, look at those fire effects, bro. That glass can break. Tip my hat to Treyarch. Oh my goodness, the orange rendering is great. Look at the fruit rendering in this game. That is just beautiful. Beautiful fruit rendering. Oh my goodness, look at the pixelation on the walls. Oh, this mannequin's even freakier. Oh, just take in that beautiful scenery outside. Just just take it in. Ugh. Gotta love the uh, smell of pixels, I guess. Oh my goodness, look at this vase. Look at this vase. It's beautiful. Not. It's freaking ugly. This is like... Xbox 360 quality right here. There's the original mannequins, if, if you didn't know. They, they look really ugly as well. But they're more of an Easter egg, so it's okay. Look at that toy. Oh, yeah. And, yeah, look at the house. It's got nice lighting, I guess. And then you got the sky. It's so beautiful. The sky isn't actually downscaled. I think it doesn't do that. Oh, my goodness, these plants are ugly. You know, hip fire is just that good. It's like, look at how freaky these mannequins look. Like, legit. Look at this tomato plant. Oh my goodness. This, oh, what is up with your eye? Oh my goodness. That is that is not okay. That is not okay. Alright, moving on to the garden. Um, I don't even know. I simply don't know, like, what is up with this garden? Like, look at this garden. Oh my goodness, oh, look at it all. Oh, take in the scenery. Ah, take in that pixely scenery. Sorry about the black borders. I don't know why the recording software actually took in the black borders, but you know what? It can be forgiven. Because technically the black borders should make it look less pixelated than it really is looks like to me so that's all right also this car has insane destruction physics still but that mirror floats which is kind of weird but it can be shot and the doors they like they can swivel open like you can legit push these doors it's great yeah i just love the attention to detail that Treyarch put into this game it's great and the fact that you can scale down your graphics enough to run it on most potatoes like my laptop potato was able to run Black Ops 3. It's just that, uh, for some reason, it wasn't able to record it. All 
Alright, ugh, forget this. Let's... Alright, I hope you found this tutorial useful. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe for more content like this, and if always, I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.